All right, we're back yet again. Yay! Yay, we're back. We're going to play a little bit more continuation from earlier. All the good stuff. I hope everybody is doing okay. I won't do an advertisement on Twitter or all that good stuff if you want. But uh, that's okay. Everything will be fine. But anywho. Bonk. And then for those that may be new, look at that booty. Look at that booty. All the booty. Maybe a little bit more booty hole. You might get to see a little bit more booty hole. Maybe not my booty hole, but you know it's gonna be some booty holes happening. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Raja. Isn't it great? Just the himbo. All the himbo things. Bunkity bunk bunk. All the himbos. There we go. All oh, right. Anywho, we'll get started here. There we go. Alrighty. We're gonna get going. Bunkity bunk bunk. Alright, through. Smells like burnt flesh in here. Ain't polite to stare, Wormwalt. If you ain't got the guts to get branded, clear off. Priestess will sort you out. Only thing she likes more than praying is burning folk. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. I ain't never felt so strong. Now, here's somebody special. The Absolute has touched you, hasn't she? Priestess Gut needs to touch you, too. Hold out your arm so I can mark your flesh. Shows our devotion to the Absolute. These maggots see how strong we are with her guidance. Whole camp will be branded soon, and you should be too. You ready? Brace yourself. This'll sting. Yeah, of course she disapproves. Yep, oh, I'm getting branded. Hold still. Oh, I this like how it goes through the glove. Your thoughts, your minds become entangled. A familiar sensation. She too carries a parasite. Darkness oh my. seems to swallow the temple, leaving you with a vision of the goblin priestess receiving instruction from a handsome young man, one of the chosen. Crow, how the dare you! Dissolves away. You stand before the goblin. Hey, priestess my chat thing's working again. again. Yay! Of course it works now after the first thing you typed in. Oh my god. Oh my god. Of course it works with that. Apparently. Oh my god. <laughs> Crow, why? Crow? Why? Why? Her faith 
floods into you, a tide of shuddering ecstasy. Her tadpole nestles within that mania. Get back to your, Secure. uh... Hidden. You know what? Kill blades for me. I just, feel you just, in there. just glock Deep him in the in back. Around. Okay, crow. Works both ways. And I saw some weird shadows swimming around in your head just now. Maybe I can help with that. Us true souls gotta look out for one another. You've come to the right place. With the Absolute's will, I can fix anything. Let's deal with this in my chapel. It's private. Don't want this lot interfering with true soul business. Oi! Priestess! We want like the mark! Yeah. Why do they think they're talking Ain't to a god? Ain't we good enough for the Absolute? <laughs> Well, this turned interesting. Well, let's see what's in this crazy castle. Biggest bloody pigeon I ever saw. But I can't believe the chat works now. It works again. Offering my pigeon, he's mine. Mm, slightly drunk. Keep him safe. Listen to him coo. Till I get hungry or some such. What's it to ya? Then catch one on your own. Okay, lady. The mark glows, but you feel nothing in response. Your illithid power is beyond reach until you rest. Okay. Oh my god, are you kidding me? No. Actually, well, might as well do a long rest then, real quick. Oi, Ribbo! There's the prisoner. Ain't a prisoner. He's my pigeon. Oh. The air is heavy. Moisture drips down your forehead. Pain shoots through your fingers. Your finger traces the arc of your lips. Wetness, sweat, blood, and saliva mixed into one viscous liquid. Oh, she's around. Don't kill me. 
took your gate of Lakith Mazathok. Can you feel it crawling through you? Tendrils squirming in your chest, gripping your heart, piercing your belly. Your bones popping, your flesh swelling. I can. I see it in you. I feel it in me. We are lost. I will be quick with my blade. First you, then the others, then myself. Your minds intertwine. You sense a touch of uncertainty, a touch of disgust. Don't kill me. Well, at least we made it through. Bah! I cannot trust my own mind. So it seems I must trust yours. I will wait. But know this. I am watching. If the sickness does not pass come dawn, I will end us all. Oh my, what's happening now? I came just in time. <gasps> my other husband is transforming. salvation and not for the first time I saved you before Yoink. oh so he's I'm the one to save you again don't worry you will not become a mind flayer not while I'm around I'll protect you. Eh. It'll be fine. We haven't much time, so listen closely. There is great potential within you. It comes from that parasite. Your instinct is to resist the power it gives, but you must accept it. Oh, no. Nurture it. No. I will keep it from consuming you. But for the sake of both of us, you must learn to wield it. Change that, but only if you embrace your potential. I have to go. The enemy is closing in. I will be back. Uh, sir? I have questions. Feel better. I promise. Sir, I have so many questions. <gasps> the doggy.
Oh, everybody loved that. Everybody loves a good puppy. Well, this is a different campsite from the one I was in earlier. Well, let's go talk to our uh, wizarding friends, I guess. My apologies. Huh. Not quite myself just yet. I had a strangest dream last night. A visitor came to me. A vision of unparalleled beauty and power. She oh, told me. Man. She was watching over me, protecting me, and that our tadpoles could prove beneficial if we embrace what powers they have to offer. An uncanny apparition. Not entirely sure what to make of it. In all my readings on the effects of illithid parasites, I've never come across any accounts of correlating dreams between infected parties. Another unique quality of our predicament, perhaps. Hmm. Oh, my. Are you inclined to take these visitors at their word? I might. I mean, he was pretty hot. So we have far more to learn about the powers of play. I mean, he was hot. Our ignorance as to the exact nature and intent of our saviors is hardly cause for celebration. I hope your confidence proves well founded. God knows we could use all the help we can get. We sure can, and now we got a doggo. I had the strangest dream last night. Uh, there was a visitor promising me protection and all sorts of delicious powers from the parasites in our heads. Given our shared affliction, I suppose you had a similar dream. Excellent. Now we can see what these tadpoles can do for us. Exactly. Waste not, want not. Even when it comes to mind flare parasites. Now, was there anything else? I had a dream last night. A vivid one. And so did you, judging from the way my tadpole is tingling. Someone came to me and promised to protect me while claiming that the parasite could empower me. Tempting as these powers sound, we should recognize this dream for what it is. The tadpole's little trick. Yeah, we'll find no out. No good ever came from trusting honey-tongued strangers conjured up by a lithid worms. I wouldn't advise it. Play with fire and you get burned. That's always the way of it. Eh, we'll be fine. He brings to mind a story. The Devil with the Silver Tongue. An old fairy tale my father read to me. The kind with a hero, a villain, and a moral. A farmer made a deal with the devil, so the story goes. In exchange for the farmer's dearest fruit, the devil granted him a bottomless coin purse. The farmer's hmm. dearest fruit, naturally, was no apple nor peach, but his beloved daughter. We can learn a lot from fairy tales, don't you think? Refuse him, no matter how tempting the offer, no matter how delicious the feast he lays out for you. The cost will be too great. That's because you still have hope. 
But when he becomes your last hope, remember this. Oh, no. He'll require of you only what you're least ready to part with. And then require more still. You we'll might be think fine. you'd give up anything for a cure. We'll but be the fine. devil won't take just anything. He'll take everything. All right. Carlax fires raged in Baldur's Gate before she escaped to Avernus, as my source told it, and she was planning to return. One of the Arch Devil Zariel's own, Chaos Incarnate, a devil with pure fire for a heart. I made my way to Avernus to stop her. She fled from my reach, even climbed aboard the Mind Flayer ship as it screeched through the hells. I followed in close pursuit. I can't bear to imagine the lives Karlak might be taking, the damage she might be doing. Hmm. A powerful friend with a keen interest in privacy. Of course you won't delve I'm sworn any to say info. No more. All right. What else is on your mind? A most vicious one, in fact. It's made from pure bloodstone, carved from the Galena Mountains just north of the Moon. Oh, sea. look, you got a fake eye too, that just sometimes like me. Blood must be shed and sacrifices must be made. Ah, but that story is reserved for lifetime friends and karma days. By all means. What else is on your mind? My father once said, one does not pursue a champion's life. One merely answers its call. So it was for me. I was hunting near the cloakwood when I heard it. A child crying out from a lone farmstead. I found him in the fields flanked by goblins. His mother's corpse bled into the soil next to him. I don't Ew. remember much of the battle. But I remember drying the boy's tears after. I left him with his uncles. Five years on, and he's flourishing. If only every child was so lucky. I mourn the ones I could never save, whose cries I never heard. In the boy's tears, I finally saw the suffering wrought by the villains of the wild. The frontiers demanded a blade, and so I heeded. Baldur's Gate, born and raised, the only son of a single father. He wanted one life for me. I chose another. We haven't spoken since I left the city. A classic drama. <laughs> a staunch father and his rebellious son. Better heard from the bard's <laughs> lips than mine. Okay. Oh... The Blade of Frontiers at your calling. Make some room and I'm all yours. All right, I know exactly. All right, you. So I'm kind of our, uh. Glick. I had a dream, as we all did, I suspect. Someone came to me and promised to protect me while claiming that the parasite could empower me. The parasite has taken root, it would seem. Every word, every promise, it is gate deception. You're delusional. I'd sooner trust a night hag than a strange figure bearing dream gifts. Chuck, you believe you can survive without me? As you say, 
Do not keep me waiting. It'll be fine. Well met. That's the spirit. All right, let's level him up. That might not be a bad idea for now. We're good for now. Alrighty, let's see. What else can we get for him? That might come in handy. 
All right. Actually, yeah, let's do that. Here we go. Eh, we're good for now. That'll work. All right, let's talk to this hoe. Did you have any strange dreams of late? Vivid ones. Damn. I was hoping my imagination had gotten the better of me. But this must be something more. This dream companion wanted me to use the tadpole, use its power. Whoever it was claimed to be an ally, but I don't know. It seems like we can't escape this mess, in the waking world or otherwise. I know. I don't understand how exactly, but I felt it go to you. It's important. I don't Keep want it. Keep it close. I don't want it. I do, but the artifact has a will of its own and powers to enforce it. It likely won't let me take it back. The best I can do is to stay close. Bide my time. Eventually, I'll need to take it. Then, I'll have to see what can be done about that. I suppose, if we're going to keep helping each other, I might as well tell you. I was part of a group sent to retrieve it. Bring it to Baldur's Gate for our goddess. I worship Shah. The mistress of the night. It's my mission to deliver the artifact to her secret cloister in Baldur's Gate. <laughs> it hurts. Uh... Now that you have the truth, please don't make a big fuss about it. Forever, ideally. And you assume too much about what I can and cannot tell. Secrecy is everything for Shah's children. It is our code, our creed, our shield. I even keep secrets from myself. I had my memories suppressed, so that nothing I know could be used against the Dark Lady. Once I prove myself, my memories will be restored. That's still I'm not shifty. Sorry I kept this from you. Not one bit. Though, perhaps that might change. If you can show an open mind. I mean, I'm a monk. Don't thank me. I'm breaking Lady Shah's teachings just by doing so. But sometimes you have to be practical. We'll save that for another time. But for now... I spy with my little eye. Yeah. Nothing of note, really. Bonkity bonk bonk.
Bunkity bunk bunk. Exploring a campsite. This one's a different one. Hey, it's Mr. Withers. Not Wondered where you this were. one. Nor this one. And this one, no less worthy still. I riddle thee not. I speak only what requires telling. Beyond mortal realms, there doth exist an amalgamation of spirits akin to thine own, ensnared by the treacherous cult of the Absolute, felled in its name. They bear great discontentment with their destiny. For a mere pittance of coin, I might summon the worthiest among them to lend aid to thy undertaking. Hmm. Most willingly, forsooth. Their passions doth run deep for what hath been wrought upon them. Very well. Yeah, we'll pursue it. Where we have it as an option now. Lands go. All right, let's leave the camp. Boy, Ribbo, there's the prisoner. Gate, this is mine. All right. Well, let's see. Let's see what's around. Those eyes. Again. Do you want to become spider food? Message from the guards. Yes. We got visitors. Don't know who they are. Mercenaries, maybe? Interesting. What are they delaying? Drow wants to know exactly where they are. Hmm. First, let me talk to a uh, creepy lady over here. And see if she can do anything with our little tadpoles. A traitor. Not the jingle of coin, I hear. Already turned quite the profit today. So I'm feeling generous. Aye, so you have. There's one place the Zentarim can trade openly, thank the gods. Folk up here like to quiver over right and wrong. Until the coin starts clinking, anyway. It's just business. If there was money in being good, the Zentarim would be pure as paladins. You joking? Goblins sell the best prisoners. Till this crowd can no complaints mine i just sold enough smoke powder to cover the loss 10 times over all i need to there's an i have to find my still some deals to be done here though you want to trade or what yeah let's trade let's see what you got and if anything i need to get rid of some crap Or apparently, oh yeah, that's right. I already sold all my crap. Uh.
will talk to her later. You've wandered into a forbidden area. You sense it might be time to leave. You've wandered into a forbidden okay. area. You don't have permission to be here. You're about. You must keep going. You've been caught trespassing. Again. Look, lady, I'm just trying to get through. You've been seen re entering a forbidden. Okay. It seems the rules have not changed in your. Okay. Come on. Come on. That was weird. Still alive. So that's progress. Would have been great to be like, oh hey. Wonder if the gods are watching me. Oi, come here. I ain't waiting around. Ready to clear your head. Whatever the absolute tells me to. Don't worry, she loves you. I can tell. Don't want a crowd of gorpers. Everybody else needs to leave. Ready to clear your head. Don't want a crowd to go. Hmm. You have my attention. On my way. Still breathing, despite everything. I don't like Ready this. Ready to clear your head. Smart. All you need to do is open yourself to the absolute. And I'll do the rest. Don't want anyone peeping on private matters. So. There we go. Secret and safe. Well, secret. Psionic feelers creep across your mind like a pick. Pockets, oh, of fingers course. seeking flaws in fabric. It's all slippery in there. What are you hiding? An image of the mind flayer reaches out to her from your memories. Out! We need to fish that thing out before it eats any important parts of your brain. Don't you worry. I've got everything I need to fix you. Might get a bit messy, though. It involves you putting your trust in the absolute. Simple. You won't regret this. Being a true soul, you know the absolute don't like to touch nothing unclean. So drink this. It will purify ya. You recognize telltale flecks of werejackal blood. It's a potion of sleep. We're doing this, Chet. This could have gone easy for you. Not now, though. I'll tear you to shreds. Of course. Of course. This will be fine. Hmm.
That won't work. Again. Again. Of course she fails. Of course she fails. <laughs> ah, 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 come on, stop failing. There we go. Torment. 
Hmm. We're getting there, but holy hell. I, I made enemies of a lot of people. Can't slow down. All right, let's see if we can kill her off. I wonder. I'm just curious. Hmm. All right. Well,
Hmm. I guess what we could do, we can lure them in. Oh, there's something over here. Let's light them up. Hmm. 
Well, that ain't good. I'll just let them come to me. Of course she healed low, of freaking course. Oh, you're joking.
Oh yeah, it is. Need to find a way forward. Hope your soul is in good hands. Try something else. Of course, he misses. This is turning into a hot mess. Uh. He misses. Uh. Okay, that's not a good spot for her.
You've made a grave mistake. <laughs> Well, well, things are not looking good for our intrepid heroes. Things are not looking good. Oh, do I have an AoE? I'm an idiot. We're probably going to die. Eliminated one. Just let it take the bait. Crit hit one.
No time to waste. We're gonna hope for the best. Not what I was hoping for, but it works. Oh. Ow. Oh god, he summoned the thing. No! <laughs> Of course, it misses. One down, many more to go. All right, two goblins down. Freaking kidding me. Of course, not enough movement. Finding my way. be fine. It's still alive. <laughs> no.
and of course it misses again. But thanks for being a distraction, spiritual weapon. Wait, there's a hidey hole? Fist to cuff the dude. Do you have a potion? No. This guy is, uh, he's a hurtin'. Dumb bastard, die. <laughs> oh my god. I don't fancy their chances. Yeah, it's looking bad, Taz. Please don't hop over the thing. Okay. There there it's making its way downtown. <sighs> well, fall by my hand. <laughs> I probably should have moved him, but <laughs> that's okay. This guy is like barely holding on to. Since they're no longer trying to hop over that way. Let's finish this.
And uh, we're just gonna skippity hoppity over here for, the for now. Finally killed one with a magic missile. All right, run away! Eric Four. Okay, we're getting there. Oh, yeah, that might help. Time to waste. Bunkity bunk bunk. Ready. Path is interrupted. Oh boy. Ew, that cloud thingy sucks. Feel my mistress's wrath. Kidding me. That freaking blind cloud can eat a bag of dildos. Oh, of course, this one is, uh, oh, that one's making it way downtown. Try. Are 
you kidding me? Can't give up. Not now. All right, that one's down. All right, we're getting there, folks. Unleash me. We are slowly but surely getting there. Mine is the advantage. Eat this. The bled dry, and still the blade thirsts. <laughs> we made it through. First things first. Uh, awake and alert. Yes. Oh my god, that was... Oh... Alright, what now? We made it, but holy hell... Oh my god, chat. That was... That was something. I don't know how. It was looking very grim for a long time. <laughs> Like, legitimately, it looked really bad for a while. But we killed the priestess. And yeah. Never wanted the easy path. Yeah, I was gonna say they were merciful indeed. Holy hell. Yeah, that's apparently the one warrior I knocked out. Ooh, look at all the wine. All right. Yeah, the red dot was that one dude we apparently knocked out, so... Dang, yeah, locked it. I'm okay with that. All right, what's in you? 
Ooh, lots of money. Just curious. Oh? A rocky crevice. Not a chance I'll fit in there. Well. Looks like I'm shrinking people again. Do I have a level two with him? Which way to the nearest library? So that could be the other thing. I shrink him down, but oh boy. Is that blood? No, never mind. <clears throat> Speaking of, that was a long battle. Holy hell. Uh, I'll have to revisit this room. Um, it's the only other possibility of what I could do. Just have to make our wizard make us into shrinky dinks for a minute. But hmm. let me explore the place just in case if I make anything hostile or things just randomly respond out of nowhere. But Since, you know, I kind of killed their priest. What'd you do that made them angry? Um, I killed their priestess. Nope, that person's apparently hostile. Okay. Fine with me. Intervention. Well, she's dead. I will free him in a little bit, but for now, let's uh, <laughs> let's weigh our options. Hold on. <laughs> Am I entirely hostile in this place? Oh, yeah, I am. Hmm. 
Hmm. Well, I think I just pissed off the entire goblin sanctum. Of course they're low rolling. There we go. I didn't want to make the entire camp hostile. Well. Yeah. We'll go back to that save if we can't, but. Oh boy. Because I really do want to make everybody hostile right off the bat. So So we're back here. Okay. Moving in. Well, we have all of our items and shit again. The help. Nick, someone the parasite has taken root. Chuck, you believe you can survive as you. All right, talk to all these My people again. An uncanny apparition. Another unique quality of our predicament, perhaps. Hmm. Are you in? I hope your confidence proves well founded. God knows we could use all the help we can get. And of course, pet doggo. Pet doggo. All right, so now I, I gotta do all these dialogues so again. Uh, no good ever came from trust. I wouldn't advise it. Play with and a farm. The farm. We can learn a lot from fairy tales. Don't you think? He'll require of you, and then re you might. But the devil won't take just anything. You can't. One of the. She fled. I can't bear to imagine the lives Karlak might be taking, the damage she might be doing. A powerful friend with a keen inch. All right. What else is on your mind? My. So it was. I was. I found. I don't remember. I. I. In the boy. The frontiers demanded a blade. Ball. He wanted a classic drama. <laughs> a storm. It's me. 
Ah. Sorry but if I'm skipping through this path. For life by... What else is on your mind? That's... All right, so we gotta go through that again. All right, we're still gonna keep his spells the way they were. So it, well, actually, hex. I really don't want. Actually, no. Yeah, we'll still keep that. And then it was animal speech. And then this time I'm just going to switch Agonizing Blast, have a Charisma modifier to it. It's the only change I'm going to make for him. I think the only different thing, well, I shouldn't say the only other different thing. Uh, the other different thing I was planning on was, uh... Given shared affliction. X. Now we can see what these tadpoles. X. Now was there anything else? Bonkity bonk. Then we're gonna go talk to her. Did you have any strange dream, Dad? This. It seems like we can't. I know. I don't understand how exactly. I do. The best I can do is to stay. I should. I was. <laughs> now that you have the truth. Please, don't make a big fuss about it. Forever, I secret. I... I'm not sorry, I... Though, perhaps that might change. If you can show an open mind. Don't thank me. The wound on my hand. It never quite heals. I'll try my best. But... I cannot say. Not with what I can recall. But even then, it's difficult to say. I'd like to hope there's more to it than that. Some meaning that Lady Shah will reveal. It's less difficult than you might. Pain is sacred to followers of Lady Shah. Pain will give way to loss and then to the peace of her eternal darkness. You can tolerate a great deal of suffering so long as it ha- Yeah, it'll be fine. But anywho, back to where we were. Yeet! This is mine! Alright, this time we are not gonna start <laughs> freaking. <laughs> freaking making all the goblins freaking hostile. <laughs> suspicious while it's watching you see that I what's it floating about best hope it don't take a fancy to ya unless you like playing hide and seek when you try to take a damp mm. well if that's how you get your kicks ain't no business of mine but when you're taking a tinkle be sure to wave eh? the big wigs at moonrise love a good show I'll stop following you, eh? Alrighty. This time we're gonna start with her first instead. Mistress! It's me, your loyal servant, Sazza. 
I'm back! And I brought a friend. A drow? Tell me, Saza, did your misadventures take you to the Underdark? They was in some rickety druid grove, mostly full of tieflings, but them intruders you're after were hiding out there. I presume you dealt with my prey and massacred the rest. Ah, oh. well, the thing about that is they sort of massacred us, but this mug helped me to escape. I say we stick a few holes in him. Show how grateful we are. You feel a cold hand caress your mind as the drow appraises you. Oh, dear. Your prisoner is one of the Absolute's favorites, Saza. A true soul. No, a compi. They was in the grove, hanging around with the tieflings. Undercover, no doubt. Carrying out the Absolute's will. Oh, Saza. You have made a grave error. And it will be your last. My spiders are hungry. Oh, Goa. my. But before they feast, tell me where that grove is. And I may yet spare your life. It's past the bridge, to the east. Big old gate covered in ivy. Don't hurt me, mistress, please. I will not hurt you. My spiders will have that pleasure. No, I mucked up, I'm sorry. But I didn't know who they was. They didn't tell me nothing. You could have told me who you was. Somebody help! <laughs> Through sheer luck, that pathetic worm has brought me the information I need. And it seems that the inhabitants of the grove trust you. We can use that against them. You have a part to play in this slaughter. Return to the grove. When my raiding party approaches, throw open the gate and signal me. The fate of the grove's inhabitants hangs in the balance. Killing the drow here would spare them, but it might be better to face her warband at the grove itself on familiar ground. On the other hand, participating in the slaughter as she asks may be the perfect way to earn her trust and access to the cult's inner circle. I do not intend to lead a suicidal charge. The goblins are expendable. I am not. The Absolute brought you here for a reason, to throw open those gates and crush our enemies. Take care of it, quickly. You are needed here, and my patience wears thin. Come on, sniveling wretch in the time to feed the crawlies. The village to the east. It's abandoned. Looks that way. But scouts said they heard something moving around out there. Something big. It's not our concern. Our prey is elsewhere. Hmm. <laughs> so she dies anyway. That's funny. That's hilarious. Okay. <laughs> oh my Shh. 
Shugon and Shukok, Ota Shokek Dors! I command you, corpse. Speak! Reveal truth to the Absolute! By Balderan's bones. Nothing. Must be reading it wrong. Shugon and Shukok! You know... This is the big boss. Strike him down. The Hobgoblin turns to you, and the parasite squirms in your skull. You taste the ale on his tongue, and the bile in his soul. The visions cloud your inner eye for a brief moment once again. You see the Hobgoblin bowing before the armored elf you'd glimpsed before. The elf speaks of the hunt for a great weapon, and the rewards that will go to whoever finds it. The Hobgoblin's eyes gleam hungrily. Another drow true soul. As if there weren't enough of you. <laughs> he doesn't speak his next words, yet they still rattle your skull from within. You ever talk to a dead squid? Now's your chance. This Mind Flayer's build is smaller, its garb plainer. A fearsome creature even in death, but not the one that tormented you. Yet it too roamed the Nautiloid. It would have seen you, known you. Absolute says the dead Squiddy had a weapon. I reckon the killer nabbed it and scooted off to that looter camp. We find who killed it, and we find who took that weapon, so settle in. You feel Shadowheart's anxiety. The weapon the Absolute seeks. It's the artifact that she carries. The same one that protected you as you entered the Goblin camp. Her hmm. mind focuses. Their suspicion cannot be aroused. They cannot discover that the weapon they seek is within their grasp. Your skull sizzles with Ragslin's displeasure. His mouth is still, but you hear his demand. I speak for the Absolute, and I say, you stay. You choke on black smoke as the Hobgoblin bellows his incantation. I command you, corpse. Speak and say sooth. Lucan Ock, I'll call deck Shulko Kank. No, no. The hideous corpse rises, tentacles writhing. Your heart seizes, and are questioning the creature might recognize you as its killer. Okay, we made it. I'm probably gonna still load my old save file with the Rex one killing the priestess, but then comes. He will speak as you command. With Ragslin's voice, you ask. Salute. Ragslin frowns in confusion at a question he would never have asked. Then the creature speaks in visions. Curved drow blades, crude goblin torches, null teeth dripping blood. You see other mind flayers arranged in a serene circle. Absolute unity. 
Absolute power. Damn it! That tells me nothing! You feel Ragslin's suspicions. He'd never have asked about his master. You remain in control. Barely. What did the killer want? Ragslin's mind is clouded by doubt. Surprised once more by words he didn't expect. Again, visions flow through you. A swarm of Githyanki dragon riders. Silver blades held high. Control panels melting. Flesh pods spilled open. Gith on the hunt. They know something. Suspicion floods Ragslin's mind. Your brain howls as you force a final query into his throat. Why were the Gith chasing that ship? You see dark tunnels lit by noxious pools of brine. The darkness spreads through the earth. The sky splits open and nautiloids pour out of a void that consumes the stars. What in the... The corpse collapses, silent once more. No, no! I'm not done! Riddles, all of it, and nothing to show for the trouble but rotting squid meat. No answers, no killer, and no damned weapon. <sighs> that damned trow was right. Can't let her get all of that glory. Seems I ain't done with you. Report to the trow. Minthar is the name. Already She's did. mounting an attack on that blasted grove. Tell her you'll join her. Praise the Absolute. No prizes for guessing what this weapon yes. they're after. I'm just doing a little exploring before I reload that save. Oh, hello.
I'm more than likely gonna just reload the save that I killed the priestess with anyway, but uh Sorry folks, I'm I'm gonna be hijacking a couple things. Oh no. They're just having a bit of fun. Oi, so much fun that those thieves almost got past. We got Hmm. Humans ain't good for much, but they make tasty beer. Magic again. So I grab his hand and crush it. Crank. No more sparkly stuff for him. Then he lifts up this place. What's another drink? Keep that bird away from the merchandise. Well now, you look like a toughen, but have you got smarts, skills, guts? No doubt, mate. This. It's got feathers, don't it? A beak. Besides, I reckon it owes us seeing as how it just ate our last chicken. Reckon it owes us a game. You want to hear the rules or... Oh, come on. You just got to chase the chicken through the court. Got to do it fast and got to... Simple, like I say, but not easy. No skin off my... Yeah, don't mind me. Like I said, I'm just scouting around for things. Oh, hi. Says here the goblinoids are obstreperous and malodorous. What's that mean? Ain't that the truth? 
proper stink around here. Now we've said it. <laughs> and all that ruckus makes it hard to concentrate on reading. That's what the bloke who wrote this said. So did you think they've locked him in the cells already? Well, I had a good chin wag with him, though. Interesting bloke. He wanted to know if we felt any extra booyag in the air since converted. Magic. Priestess mm. gut and our boss Ragslin are fearsome. Seems we've pegged all three marks. Let the boss hunt begin. Yeah. Priestess gut is fierce and powerful now. So they have the kind of booyag that comes from... I... As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Hey, we made it. This stuff ain't bad. But somebody who really knows the absolute should hey, be right nursed to him. You're right. What does some bleeding out? I know, but... I'm going to have to figure out where this freaking druid is, though. It's somewhere in the camp. girl i am in danger hi crow how you doing welcome welcome you in danger girl oh now it's a massive rates maybe a little bit more booty hole you might get to see a little bit more booty hole maybe not my booty hole but you know it's gonna be some booty holes happening <laughs> yay booty holes Welcome, welcome everybody. I am Jer Bear. Typically, I do Final Fantasy XIV, JRPGs, RPGs. And today, we are continuing our misadventures. And, uh... We're trying to figure out some things before we continue trying to find a certain something. No goes. But that's okay. I hope everybody is doing well. How was your, uh... Sorry, oh, you switched to uh, Rainbow ready, Siege? Yeah. Dwarves take an age to roast. He found lads inside are trying to get answers. How? Nah, 
Druids are all being in the woods, ain't they? This hey, lot were a scabby gang of tomb robbers. Had a big old war bear with them, though. Took five of our meanest lashes to chain it up. We'll beat the fight out of it and make it one of our own. <laughs> oh, no worries, Maku. Thanks, sir. He'll probably... He's inside. I hope you're doing all right. It glitched and you kept falling through the map. I'm sorry. Oh, that's where our druid is. Maybe. Like I said, I'm probably gonna reload the save I was at before. Oh, so trial. don't mind me. Uh, uh, please, uh, if you wanna have a try. Oh, oh, of course. There's weapons in the fire if you want them. Uh, uh, come, Grush. I wanna watch that weird priest next door. Sounded like he was beating something up. But it's okay because uh we had some fun earlier let's just say that please please let me out there's no reason for this Helsin I I don't know that's all I know P please somewhere underneath the but Brian had instructions but Please, please, these shackles. I thank you. Thank you so much. I'm just seeing. It's okay. The lock. I'm clicks sorry you guys went through some glitches. Opens. All right, let's continue the shout outs because uh, there was a lot of raids. All right, and Mega's next. Here we go. Thank you. I, I, I better go. Smells like a giant in here. Oh Should my be able to God, make it to Crow, the why? The they need to know they're in danger. The, the grove to the east. They wanted to know where we came from. I don't know. He just said some wizard called Laroakan would reward us if we. Hmm. You know,
because I'm likely going to have to fight these people anyway. Actually, first, let's save this one. Just as a backup. And then we're going to load our other one. Where we uh, kind of went uh, full Rambo on everybody. Yay, full Rambo. Well, if that's the case, I kind of don't want the grove to go completely shot. So, uh, yeah. Save the bears. So, in other words, I may or may not be in a pickle for a lot of the situations that are going to be coming up. Should mind my step. So don't mind me. So this thing is going to be slightly altered. I kind of want to get their spell slot saved too. How can I help? Think of it as tribute. The cart as long as I pay, there will I can assure you. The battlefield would extend well beyond the borders of my Your enterprising approach to my problem is most encouraging. I do not yet need to consume an item, but keep it close by. It will not be too much longer. Alright, that's fine. Oh, uh, let's go through our supplies. Bunk. Eat all the potatoes, eat all the lalafels. Eat them all. You don't sleep well, flitting between dreams and nightmares. Mainly because this safe, maybe I kind of used a bunch of. Uh... You know something is wrong, or maybe. You just get lucky. Oh. Sir. Shit. No, no. It's not what it looks like. I swear. I... I wasn't going to hurt you. I... I just needed... Well... Blood. There, Sir. in the dim firelight, you see him for what he really is. A vampire. A slave to sanguine hunger. <laughs> Pick up. Oh. He was just hungry. It's not what you think. I'm not some monster. I feed on animals, boars, deer, kobolds, whatever I can get. Don't kill my I'm dog, though. Just too slow right now. Too weak. Don't kill my dog, though. That's all I asked for. Blood, I could think clearer. Fight better. Please. A strange sensation courses through you, and your companion's mind unfolds. Secrets half revealed. At best, I was sure you'd say no. More likely, you'd ram a stake through my ribs. I was about to, no. sir. I needed you to trust me. And you can trust me. Thank you. Do you think you could trust me just. Just a don't eat further? me, that's all. I only need a taste. I swear. Ah, of course. I shall be gentle as a babe. Let's make ourselves comfortable, 
shall we? Oh boy. That's not awkward. It's like a shard of ice into your neck. A quick, sharp pain that fades to throbbing numbness. Your breath catches, your pulse quickens. Push him back. Oh, that. Oh, that was amazing. Sir, calm down. My mind is finally clear. I feel strong. I feel happy. Ah, don't be so dramatic. This is just a little transaction between friends. And look what you've gained. Together, we can take on the world. Shouldn't take long. So many people need killing. Now, if you'll excuse me, you're invigorating, but I need something more filling. Well, wow. This is a gift, you know. I won't forget it. You watch as he stalks off. Stronger, more confident. Ready to hunt. Hey, I got an achievement. Ah. <sighs> Well, that's reassuring. Good morning. How do you feel? Be grateful I'm not a true vampire, then. A bite from them and you might wake up as a vampire spawn, like my good self. All of a vampire's hunger, but few of their powers. Oh no, I should be cinders in this light. I hadn't seen the sun for 200 years before we crashed here. Someone, or something, wants me alive. They've changed the rules. Oh my. Standing in the sun, wading through a river, wandering into homes without an invitation. They're all perfectly mundane activities now. As for my other quirks, well... <laughs> We can figure those out in time. <laughs> you're such a sweetheart. I'm just glad you're being sensible about these... Uh, revelations. I was worried people might turn up with torches and pitchforks. Although there's still time. <laughs> a vampire? Well... That explains the pallor. Given our group's nature, I don't see much harm. We're each monsters in the making, after all. Oh, and a quick word of warning, Astarian. I taste absolutely awful. <laughs> Keep your distance. He's not wrong. We're bound together, no matter what comes. I'd just better not wake with any holes in my neck. There now. We're all friends again. Shall we go? There's a long day ahead of us. Yeah, there is, but now I'm, uh... Gimped out. No! All right. So, 
Part of me is very curious. But first... Du, 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 du. Part of me is very curious, so I'm just going to see. Choice. I'm most likely going to reload, but we're just going to see. Let's get going. Just see what's beyond. Oh, there's an ogre. Probably not for the waste of step. Hmm. Okay, I see four blank ones. I may have to make a return trip to this. Just as... Because if I'm by myself in this, it might not be good. Oh, 
Oh yeah, something tells me I don't want to be by myself down here, but... It's just the Underdark. What could go wrong? Poor. Don't say that, but also hi. How are you doing, Core? I hope you're doing okay. doing okay that's apparently protecting it <clears throat> oh boy Let's see if we can join back with our party. I'm gonna have to find an alternative route though, because I can't, uh... Shrinky dink myself back. Not so, a chance I'll fit in there. So this is gonna be interesting. Let's hope this thing isn't hostile, whatever. You've set foot in a restricted area. A swift exit may be in order. Oh, God. Oh, I definitely am not making that. Oh. You've been granted free passage. What do you do? Well, then. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Uh. Up I go, then. Do, 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 do. Where is this lead? Oh, back up here. Okay. Okay. Okie dokie. All right. So that is an alternative. Yep, back where all the corpses are. Yep. I kind of killed everybody. 
Because uh, I killed their priestess and they summoned a bunch of guards. So <laughs> somehow I was like, oh, uh, this is not going to end well. Needed a 22. <laughs> and then it was like, oh, yeah, about that. Uh, <laughs> well, we got a portal for later. As for now, this place just got a lot more interesting then. Because this entire place is hostile to me, which I am found out I'm okay with. Mainly because I found out they want to kill all the druids. So, uh... I am okay with that. And then we found out what the fate was by saving the one goblin chick anyway. So... Uh -huh. A timely intervention. All right, take the key. <laughs> Look at this. I'm quite saved. A joy to see a familiar face in such a precarious setting. Because here's the I thing, I'm not that mean. My I'm not that evil, so... Eons. I intend to do just that. A trusty invisibility potion goes a long way in a place like this. We mustn't tarry, but I'd hate for our friendship to end here. Please, won't you meet me once we've both slipped the goblin yoke? Smashing! Soon, my friend. Soon we can share the flagon of something liquid and a tale of daring do. I'll slip away when the coast is clear. See you soon, my friend. I simply can't wait to pick your brain. Do, 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 do. Bunk. Yeah, she had it coming. Not gonna lie, she had it coming. No, no. Please. Oh, don't hurt me. Uh, I, I can't tell you where the grove is. Please. If they find out, they'll... they'll kill everyone. Helsin? I... I don't know. He, he... he changed into a bear. But... I lost sight of him. I don't know if he's still alive. That's all I know. Please... get me out of here. Somewhere underneath the temple, there's a hidden passage. B Brian had instructions, but the goblins got him. Well, here's the thing. I already yeah. figured out where it was because I got the teleporter. So, please free me. So that ended up working you out don't after need all. Me anymore. That natural twenty came in real handy. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, hey, I stole the his key. clicks and opens. Okay. Apparently one of the goblins we killed, apparently, uh, lockpicked the thingy. So, that works. Thank you. I, I, I better go before they catch us. I should be able to make it to the grove on my own. They need to know they're in danger. Did, 
the grove to the east. They yeah, wanted yeah. to know where we came from. I don't know. He just said some wizard called Laroa can with the Alrighty. Well, let's collect stuff. Bunk. And, uh, make our way through. A bloody shrine. Well, I probably could have figured out in a one playthrough how to handle this, but uh, I will take the potion of healing now. I will at least do that. I leveled up. They miss as they all keep missing. Nope, don't. One health off.
I don't want to use all my key. God follows me everywhere. Light on my feet. But anywho, re-leveled up. When you fall, you can use a reaction to gain resistance to falling. Okay. Hey, I got a feet. All right. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. I get to have, yes, defeat, high quality feet. Oh my god, there's so many things to choose from! God damn, god damn, god damn. This is this is where it becomes <sighs> The real the real difficulty too. Choosing something that would actually work well. I'm debating about that one, but...
just debating stuff. You know what? We'll go with that because it'll give us move around opportunities when we're in groups and he's kind of our frontline person so that might come in handy. trip That might come in handy, so... And of course, now everybody else is getting feats as well, so...
Yes, learn all the cantrips. Oh. Mm -hmm. And we'll just do ability improvement. Sorry I'm taking so long on this, by the way. I'm just thinking a lot of options in my head right now.
Eh, fuck it. I can't think of anything worthwhile for him right now. There we go. I'm trying to remember the last time when I had to do We'll do that for her. Da, 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 da. Sorry if this is leveling hour.
We're still going to keep magic missile. All the magic missile. Is magic missile too good? Since we don't want to spend forever on that again. Funk. Let's see what's down here. Oh, hi, Mr. Goblin. Steal something. Or, or at the bollocks, will ya? I'm itching to throw someone in the brick. It'll be fun. I promise. Hmm. Let's go investigate. Well, at least these goblins are not attacking me right off the bat. Maybe they don't know what happened up above. Wish I got a turn at the bear. Lucky. <gasps> Our druid friend. She lacks critical official critical basis. She murdered everyone of the spares. Oh, yeah. Again! Again! Make it squeal again! We're juicing it up. The beast came in here with those robbers, killed Dink and Mince too. Boss is thinking of serving it to the wargs. We made it squeal. Look, look, you'll see. Give me that rock. I'll show ya. Fair. 
You go, bear. Let's F him. Oh, they're all dead. <laughs> they're all dead. I'm okay with that. Oh, hi. Here's the thing, they're they're about to die too, Taz, so uh it all works out in the end. I'm okay for that. Critical information. The critical information is really pissed off. Bear is about to eat him. <laughs> oh, yeah. They have buttoned a buttical information. The critical info button is really pissed off, but is about to eat them. Yes, the pissed off butt is about to eat them. Ah, uh, difficult terrain. Oh my god, that girl is still alive by one. By freaking one. <laughs> by freaking one. Take a whirl. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. I'm not sure why I wasted that, but all right. Of course I'd miss. No! I tried! Well, 
kill that one. All right, we killed that one too. miss how dare battle favors the fearless well this just got interesting first let's get out of the webbing all right and shoves him in the web. Come on, cave bear. Of course. Swiftly now. Run away. 
Right away! This is my time. I don't like being at that disadvantage. Okay, and then he'll get two attacks of opportunity if I move him. Alrighty. Uh... that other one. We got to whack. <laughs> really, sir? Yeah, you go bear. I will. Hope for the best. I think you can take me on. Oh, <laughs> forgot about that guy. Thanks for lurking chat, by the way. I appreciate you. Because we're, uh, hoping for the best. There we go. And yeah, we'll keep him up there. You Eldritch Blast, you all right. Don't have to worry about him freaking doing things I shouldn't have to worry about. All right. Yeah, let's help the bear out. There we go. Yay, cave bear. Oh, 
Oh, of course. Dice roll in my favor. Shall be done. Uh, we'll hope for the best. Hey, just enough. Pardon the viscera. One should cherish all of nature's bounty, but goblin guts are quite far down the list. You aided a bear without knowing if it would savage you. <laughs> a true friend of nature. Or perhaps a lunatic. Either way, I owe thanks. I am the druid Halson. Parasites in your head that... You mean you have one of them? Father, preserve you, child. You're infected, aren't you? The mind flares spawn. But something's different. You're aware of the monster inside you. You don't bow to the absolute like the true souls do. How is this possible? Perhaps, but I wouldn't want to place all my faith in blind luck. You weren't speaking lightly when you said you needed help. Let me tell you what I know. I've been studying these parasites for a while now. Ever since I discovered these so-called true souls are infected with them. Someone is using very powerful magic to modify these tadpoles. They're using them to exert control over the infected. I'm sorry to say, I can't undo that magic, which means I can't cure you. But that doesn't mean I can't help. I didn't find what I came here for, a way to remove the tadpoles. But I found the next best thing. I found out where they come from. That must be well, where these enchantments that means we're are placed on them. Fucked a little bit. And it's where you'll find your cure. Indeed. After we dealt with the drow that ambushed us, Nettie and I were able to inspect the corpse and the creature that slithered out of it. I had no idea anyone beyond their ranks was infected. You have my sincere sympathies. No, this is... different. Altered. The magic used is beyond me. It's either not of this world or so ancient as to be lost to even nature's memory. Patience. I can't just snap my fingers. But I know where the solution almost certainly lies. I overheard that the cultists are sending all of their captives to Moonrise Towers. Innocents go in, true souls come out. Given that all of these true souls are infected, it has to be the source for this magic. If you want to find a cure, you must head there and discover how the tadpoles are being manipulated. I wish I could. But there's still work I've yet to finish. Blood I've yet to spill. I've no right to ask more of you. But if you could help me, I'd be free to join your journey to Moonrise. Oh, yeah, I cannot allow these butchers to threaten my grove. The natural order must be protected. My thanks. If you prevail, I'll owe you the debt of a lifetime. Rare is the beast that survives decapitation. Help me eliminate the Drow Minthara, the Hobgoblin Draw Ragslin, and that perversion of a priestess, Gut. Oh, I already they killed are the, the priestess. Ones holding these parasites together. Remove them, and nature will cure itself.
You drow relish turning on your own if there's something to be gained. Don't pretend otherwise. So be it. May Sylvanus lend us nature's fury. All right, we got a guest. We got a burr. 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 Isn't he precious? I love him. Oh, whoops, didn't mean to interact with that. But now we can have our bear fun. Yay! <laughs> right? <laughs> right, chat? We can have our bear fun. Yeah. Oh, whoops, didn't mean to. Uh, there we go. We can have fun with bears now. Ooh. Journalish. Yay, boots. Well, here's the thing. We already killed one of the goblins already of the three targets, so... Alrighty, let me uh, explore this room. And then we will uh, have our ways. Hatched up, pushing on. Ooh, potions of healing. That's gonna be helpful. That'll be all right. Ooh, tre heavy treasure chest up there. All the heavy treasure chests. Oh, I'm I, I'm encumbered. Okay. Okay. Looks like I gotta donate some items to my fellow compatriots. All the vendor items, let's go. There, we got a loot.
side of the gate. What is he proficient in? We could at least upgrade her mace. Yeah, let's at least upgrade her mace at least. And might as well give that to her, too, while I'm at it. Yay! We're figuring items out. I wish there was a way to kind of... S Is there a way to sort inventory? I'm probably dumb. Mm. Oh, there is. There we go. No rest for the wicked, I see. Well, she's got a shield now. Yay, a better one. But, uh... The pride of the gate. All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. Hmm. Yeah, it was right with magic. Yay, learning spells. Sharp as ever. Can't give up now. But yeah, let me uh get rid of a couple more items. Bug, bug. Bonk. You can hold some stuff. You can hold some stuff. Yes, I am a pack rat, to say the least. But it works out. Oh yeah, I should probably give each of them a potion. Just 
just so that way they have an extra recovery in case shit hits the fan. I wonder if the guard has a key. Yep. There we go. Da 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 And of course, nothing's in here. Maybe. Nope, just more barrels. And that looks a little ripe in there. I think we're Gonna investigate these. Where am I needed? He is gonna go collect some camp supplies. Ooh. A lot of potions. Defender of the people. Okay, um, we are having a pretty long stream. Um, I'm actually also going to probably go to bed here too. We're going to investigate the rest of Goblin Camp a different day. Um, but hey, we at least killed the one thing we needed to at least for one of our objectives. So that ends up working out. But uh, I think I'm going to call it there for tonight. We will, like I said, we'll pick this up. Maybe tomorrow? Maybe? Um, I know we're doing Criterion stuff tomorrow. So I'm likely going to be in that. But maybe afterward? Question mark? So, because again, I'm really enjoying this game a lot. My, uh, me enjoying a couple of these things here and there is actually pretty fun. Um, with that, we're going to end our stream there. If you are new here, feel free to check out socials. And also, apparently, during the middle of this stream, apparently the chat thing finally worked for the chat displays on stream. Yay! But uh, I will continue this fun adventure. Uh, thank you for lurking. And uh, for those that hung around, hope you enjoy those drops. Um, I will take requests for anybody to raid. Because uh, I have nobody to raid right now. So if there is anybody somebody wants me to send them to, I can easily do that. If there is somebody in mind, otherwise I have nobody in my sights right now.
Well, I guess if nobody has anybody to raid, we will just end it there for tonight. Because like I said, I really don't have a target I can kind of fling you guys at, so... But, alright. Uh, till next time, folks. Be good people. Have all the kisses and loves out in the world. And, uh, I will see you next time. Mwah. Bye!